Good afternoon. I'm Sharon Mincha. We begin as children across the Houston area head back to school. It is year two of the state takeover for HISD, but it's not the only local district starting classes today. As your education station, we have team coverage this afternoon as the new school year begins. And for some districts, things got off to a rough start as frustrated parents dealt with school bus route issues. Katira Winfrey live at Sinclair Elementary in HISD. Katira. Sherman, many of the parents I spoke to have multiple children in the district and they are at multiple schools, many waiting for bus route assignments that never came. So some parents drop their kids off at school, but others say they're not optimistic about what the rest of the year will bring. Summer break is officially over for students in HISD, and while they are dressed and ready to go, getting the class might be difficult. It's a problem if you ask Alexis Payton. Yes, ma'am. You know it's first grade. Sunday night, HISD said around 700 students were still being assigned their bus stops. HISD did approve a list of phone numbers for parents to call to expedite their bus route information. Payton's son is starting middle school and at this rate doesn't know when he'll get a route. They don't work. The, uh, the website been down. You can't even call when you call. They say they are, are out of service. To avoid the delay, he'll drive. That's what Adriana Spivey Bailey is doing for her children. All three attend different schools. And they're all in the magnet program, so they all go to schools outside of our zip code. So we really, really need to know. The district transportation website says routes are being updated and parents should check back at the end of July. It's August and parents are still waiting. Caesar de Serta has children in different schools. One bus arrived nearly on time, but he had to drop off another. Confused because you can't get them on the phone. The systems, the phone system's down. Not sure if they're communicating and saying, hey, you're routes on the way. Peyton also has safety concerns for his son and walking to school isn't an option. Really ma'am, I don't. I'm not optimistic. That's why I'm just keep doing what I do. And HISD previously said they were cutting bus routes to cut down on ride time, but they are also um, they I've also reached out to HISD for comments about the phones being down and also about the bus route assignments and I am waiting to hear back. Reporting live in Houston, Katira Winfrey, KHOU 11 News.